Face masks, these face masks are the most important, powerful public health tool we have. More than 224,000 Americans have died from COVID-19 so far. These actually, we have clear scientific evidence, they work. That is a number, Willie, that is projected by the University of Washington to reach 510,000 by the end of February. They work. Unless we adopt consistent mask wearing when we're around other people, could save 100,000 lives or more. This face mask is more guaranteed to protect me against COVID than when I take a COVID vaccine. Wearing a mask might make people feel a little bit better and it might even block a, a droplet, but it's not providing the perfect protection that people think that it is. And often there are unintended consequences. People keep fiddling with the mask and they keep touching their face. If people are not wearing masks, then maybe we should be mandating it. The U.S. steamrolling through all-time highs. They work. On Saturday, notching 79,059 cases. They work. Nearly matching Friday's record. They work. But with several states not reporting over the weekend. When or if the science evolves to say that to protect ourselves and each other against these new variants, that double masking should be the recommendation, they will make that recommendation. But right now, they are just encouraging people to wear a mask. They work. Wear a dang mask when you're indoors. We're not asking you to sign up for the draft here. This morning, the U.S. crossing yet another dark milestone. They work. More than 225,000 lives lost. They work. As cases are still on the rise. They work. It's in about 80% of states. Here in El Paso, COVID-related hospitalizations are up 300% in the last three weeks. They work. We're seeing this massive rise. It's not just in one part of the country. It's across the entire country, especially in the Midwest and in El Paso, like you covered. It's unprecedented.